Hey everyone, this is Ultra Runner. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a quick look at the new SH figure of Sissoka from the uh, Soka line. Uh, actually from the Soka show. Um, this is actually their... Um, one of the few ones they have. I think this is actually the... Is it the only one from the Soka line so far? I think so. Um, I don't expect them to do too many of these because honestly, let's just be real. The show didn't do that well, but um, I'm a huge Ahsoka fan, so, you know, um, I stand for her. So, you know, along with Captain America and Boba Fett, so I had to pick this one up. Um, even though I do have the Mayfix, which I'm really happy with. Um, so I have right now, I have the Mayfix here, the um, SH Figure Arts with the Neutral Face, and then the Black Series. So I just want to, right off the bat, just kind of do a, just to kind of let you guys know, no matter what you're hearing, <laughs> the Black Series doesn't even compare compare to the SH figures or, or the um, the Mayfix. Now, a lot of people are saying that the likeness to Rosario Dawson for this one is the best of all. And I would say it's definitely very good. But if you look at the overall proportions in the build, she looks pretty scrawny. I mean, Rosario Dawson is not a huge, massive person anyway. But... Um, overall, uh, and this, this is, these are all sticking out because I had her in a pose and you know, it wouldn't go down and feel like messing with it, but fit and finish, you know, if you just had to have a soaker for the shelf, yeah, 25 bucks or now way much cheaper than that. And I, cause I do have, I think I have every Ahsoka, um, from, uh, Clone Wars to the live action. I even have the, uh, credit collection version. So I, um, I do you know, actually, I do have a lot of Ahsoka, so and this is actually the one from Mandalorian, I believe. But color-wise, you know, I think they all kind of have their points here and there. But, you know, um, if you can look at the Mayfix, to me, the Mayfix has gold versus the SHF. The Mayfix, to me, looks more like an animated version of Ahsoka, which I really like. I actually think that's kind of cool. Is it, is it supposed to be Rosario Dawson? Yeah, it's supposed to be. But um, the Black Series definitely looks more like Rosario Dawson there, but when you look at the actual outfit, and I've, I've done a review on this before, like the detail and the sculpting and the and the texture in the Mayfix is significantly better, but it also is significantly more expensive, so that's, it is what it is. To me, this is the best of both worlds. SH Figures nailed the face, like not even remotely close. They nailed the light coat. They nailed the gradient on it. The color, the texture is much, much better than the the, the um, Black Series. And it really is a lot better than the uh, Mayfix as well. Um, Articulation-wise, great posing. Um, detail to the sculpting. This is a lot bit softer than um, the black series but for the most part um so posability is good and you don't have to worry about stuff like that and of course with shf you get a lot of cool things like the loose tassels um the detail to the boots and the shoes the toe joints um so but yeah you you are getting what you pay for in that case and if you're not a huge ahsoka stand and it doesn't matter then just you know get the black series and move on with your life but for me i really want to have the best of both worlds because so i wanted to have an ahsoka um, caped up like this, one that's not, and then one that's, and you'll see later with, with the Sith face. So, um, just basically her going dark side. So, um, well, she didn't show, but she was going to actually be posed that way. Um, with the only thing with SHF and the Mayfix, which I think Black Series did better, was I don't like this. I don't like how they handled this joint instead of making it, whereas, the, whereas the Black Series. Did a great job of keeping the pants low and putting that joint integrated into. See, I don't even bend this thing, but integrated into so the knee, so the pants still hang low when you're bent, just like if it was in real life. I think they did a much better job with that. I don't know why those two guys all went to that kind of weird, uh, elongated, almost like a double joint, like they did with the elbows, but. I mean, it's fine. It's not anything that's, you know, super massive an issue for me negative-wise. Um, 
But yeah, um, out of the three, I would definitely say if I had to pick just one, I would definitely say the SHF is the better of the three. If you're looking for like the most accurate Ahsoka and a little bit of everything, you know, she does come with a couple of face plates. So you get the Sith Eyes face plate here, which stellar. And she will have that one on. Um, I'll have her on that one the whole time. And then she has the gritty face. And this is the regular eyes. You can see the eyes are blue. And they're not, um, they're not red. And, you know, the teeth is kind of weird. But, I mean, that's just close up on camera. I mean, on a shelf, you don't see that at all. Uh, she comes with a bunch of different types of hands. A couple pairs of these. Um, and this one here, you can actually fit the little map in, which is kind of neat. So she does come with the map. Uh, focus, there you go. Yeah, so she does come with the map. Um, and then she comes with a broken map that you have to just cut off because nobody really knew what this was for. But it's I guess so, so they're so small they don't want you to lose it. So you just snip off the ends here. I'm not going to do mine because I'm never going to display it that way. And then she comes with the regular lightsabers there. And then she comes with the swinging effect once here, the motion ones, which I think this is, I don't like the way this is done by any company. Um, it should be a single blade with a curved trail off of it, you know, that, how it looks like and, you know, on the movies, but it shows or whatever, but it is what it is. Um, and last but not least, she does come with the cloak. Now, this cloak is a thousand times better than a Black Series. I mean, one, because you got wires in it. Um... But the problem with it is, it's not as good as the Mayfax. So this is not wired everywhere. It's really wired only in the hood part. So the rest of this, you kind of have to just finagle and play with. The one thing I do like that they did better than the Mayfax was, this is sewn. So with the Mayfax, which I have here, they clasp it with Velcro. So it doesn't sit as tight. But the Mayfix has wire all the way through the entire piece of the cape. So, if you guys see my other video, I mean, when this is sitting on her, it looks just like it should in real life. But like, it is pretty stellar. And I'll actually probably put it back on in a bit. Um, but this is definitely the superior of the, the cloaks of all the guys. So, um, this may find a life if I can decide I want to play with it, but it may just go right literally back in the box where it came from, which is probably what's going to happen. Um, but articulation wise, um, you know, standard SHF, so nothing crazy, butterflies, um, great mobility, you know, ball joint wrist, um, good for reverse gripping. Um, you've got you know, great articulation at the waist. So, I mean, this is definitely a very acrobatic um, Ahsoka, you know, toe joints, you know, standard. So, everything you come to expect from SHF, um, but with just updated sculpting and things like that, you know, for Ahsoka. And for their, their first attempt at her, I would definitely say this is, they knocked it out the park. Um, I was expecting, usually SHF comes out first and then and Mayfix comes out and the Mayfix is always the superior one. Um I would definitely say um, out of the two, um, I like the head sculpt better on here, but I do, and the color, but I do like the body of this one more. I think this is just probably, um, it's also black instead of brown. I don't know if it's even picking up on camera, but the SHF is actually like a really, really deep brown as opposed to the Mayfix and the Black Series, which is black. Um, but, you know, um, the texture in it is better on the Mayfix. I mean, it, it looks more like material. Um, I think they did a much better job with her. But aside from that, I mean, yeah, the SHF is definitely, to me, uh, if I actually like, so got to go with one, this is the winner here. This is the your quintessential one until, of course, they come out with a Peridia version or a Soak of the White, whatever you want to call it. I know Black Series got one coming out and... I've got the hot toys on order, but um, if they do a white version, I'll pick up the Soka White too. But um, so aside from that, I think this is great pickup. And if you like her, you know, if you're a Soka fan, you know, definitely this is the one to get. So your other ones, um, even the Mayfax, and get this one here. 
or honestly, if you want probably the best Ahsoka, it would probably be this Ahsoka with this cloak. But I'm going to have this Ahsoka back like she was before where her face is kind of buried. So with the shadows and the cloak pulled over, she looks just stunning. And then this Ahsoka here, I'll switch it out and I'll put the Sith face on her. And the way this works for her is you... So that's the faceplate there. The little headband comes off and it pulls the face with it. And you have to be careful because I almost broke my clips. So there's two clips at the base here and I'll pull it off here and show you. There's two little clips here at the base that snap in along with the clear one up here. So just make sure you're careful when you pull that off. And then I'm just gonna put the Sith face on. So you just, just that just pegs in. Just like that, pretty easy, pretty pretty standard HHF stuff. And since she doesn't have hair, it just slides over the top. And you clip them in. And just like that, you're good. Now you got your Set the face is so good, and that looks really, really good. But man, that's, that neutral face is just pretty awesome. And I guess I'll spend a little see here. I never even looked at this to see how they say it's work. That the same ball joint? Oh, how about that? Look at that. Didn't even think that worked. Now the orange is off. That's for sure. It's not the same color. But yeah, you can actually put the SHF head on the Ahsoka, on the Mayfix body and vice versa. Let's see here. Yeah. And I do like the blue of the Leku compared to the, the blue of the, the gauntlets. It's a little bluer it's a little more i guess the silver kind of makes it pop more i hope those gauntlets are much different too yeah mayfakes just their detail is just crazy like super nuts but huh maybe i'll do that later on play play around with that and see which one i like the best so cool um let me know what you guys think put this back here uh, let, me know you guys think, let, me, let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. Um, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks so much. And there you go. Let me get her in a decent pose before we go. Move her out of the way. That's the scary side right there. All right, you guys have a good one. Later.